We are back. We are rifting. I'm gonna try a greater rift. Torment 13. Trying to really focus on hitting those shrines. I hate to say it, but probably the shrines are what's gonna win it this season, at least for me, anyways. Uh, I don't know if they're gonna stay as powerful as they are at the higher levels. But all I know is that once I hit a shrine, pretty much uh, everything gets wiped out. <laughs> so here we go. I'll try it. <coughs> I wish you luck. Not ready yet. See? look. Come on. Let me click on it. See me now. How is that Still waiting. Increases. 
better. I'm just warming up. Not ready yet. I had pretty good map. <coughs> good number of shrines. Let's see what we can do. I don't need this one anymore. That's my movement speed. Zero. That might help things out a little bit. but not bad. The reduce all resource costs will help that negative 6.8 to toughness as, as long as I'm wearing this. So Armor, vitality, I don't know, probably vitality is a little bit better, but let's leave it on there for now. This one isn't bad. I used to use this one a lot, but whenever you run into a opponent that relies on physical, especially a Rift Guardian, a lot of times you just you just die in one hit. Cooldown reduction. Cooldown reduction would help with my offense. That would make up for it a little bit.
and this would give me 10% damage reduction. And I'd be able to get this one faster. And then just the S of Johan effect itself. I don't know. <coughs> Hate to say it, but just not yet. I need an ancient legendary one. I'm gonna go with one-handed weapons. I uh, I haven't been doing it, but there's a one-handed weapon I'm really waiting for. It's the one for the. For the Hydra. Lucky you. Oh, that's nice. Can I have it back? And this one's good too. Losing some damage, but I'll be gaining. Two hundred and fifty percent. Probably a good deal. Reduce all resource costs, that'll be I'll be losing. I mean, I'll be gaining a little bit more uh, damage reduction. I guess I'll say goodbye to teleport, which I don't really use all that much. the best one give me more shielding <laughs> one time I miscast the charm spell and sister Lysa was fawning over me for a fortnight <laughs> it was mortifying I will go with the barrier blades. <clears throat> and I think I will take out that resource cost reduction. Hmm. Moving faster. Cooldown will give me extra damage too.
All right, we'll put a put an emerald in there. Emerald probably be best choice. Uh, how many do I get? One, three, nine, so I think I can make one of the largest. I need nine. I don't know if I've got the recipe though. I do. Probably should look at that first. <coughs> Thirty percent critical. So didn't lose too too much, at least as far as raw damage and so forth goes. But now I'll have that twenty five percent for each stack. Plus I'll have the extra protective shield. This should come in handy later on when I decide to start using Arcane Orb. So I'm gonna pump it up one more time. I think um, I should be able to with an extra 250% potential weapon damage. My Hydra should be doing a lot more as long as I'm, you know, attacking and so forth. <coughs> Probably wanna switch these out. Let's put this to Spectral Blade. This one to Hydra. Alrighty, I will be right back.